dealing with a major bee problem. We're talking tens of thousands of bees, not to mention their massive hive and pounds of honey. The bees have been so problematic in the West End area, residents have had to call in an expert. Our Keith Garvin was there for the removal. He's joining us live. And Keith, this isn't the first time they've had a suit up out there. Uh, that's correct, Dominique. As a matter of fact, uh, this home right here was bought by a single mother in 2012, and it actually had four beehives inside, but that was not disclosed to her until after she closed on the home. For various reasons, they have returned over the last few years, and she wanted to make sure the problem was fixed for good this time once her children started getting stung inside the house. Spring has barely sprung and already bees are causing problems across Houston. A large hive was formed inside the exterior paneling of this West Houston home. The children and their mother have gotten stung numerous times, making this a problem they want to go away. It's real bad. It chased my mama all the way over there. So the family called in Claude Griffin of Gotcha Pest Control, who has taken out several hives for them in the past, all for free. This time, a new hive formed after the exterior paneling was cracked. It's not only caused problems for this home, but also their neighbors. Once the source was identified, it was time to go to work. That's how they're getting in right there to the kids' back, the, the, the bedroom right there. So we're less than 10 minutes into the job, and already Claude has come across about 35,000 bees. And take a look, four large honeycombs just like this one. The goal at the end of the night is to make sure this family can feel safe sleeping in their homes again. Nearly 50,000 bees and almost 50 pounds of honey were extracted from the home. But temperatures are mild now, and pest control experts like Griffin are expecting to stay busy with bees this entire summer. The bees are free now. They can roam, and they're going to be stronger than ever. And they got all this pollen to take in. For this family, the problem finally appears to be solved, and they're just thankful to get their yard back. So we can clean the pool and um, have so much fun without getting stung. We can't wait because now we can access the pool and the kids can play out back. And hey, back here live, you're getting a look, a live look now at some paneling, temporary paneling that was placed over that hole where those bees had lodged inside and were able to form their hives. They're going to put something permanent up there, but they do believe this is going to fix that problem once and for all. And for everyone at home, just so you know, Griffin and his and assistant actually vacuumed those bees inside of a breathable cage. They weren't harmed in any way, and they're going to be transported to a beekeeper so they can continue to make honey. Reporting live from West Houston, Keith Garvin, KPRC Channel 2 News.